Hey y'all, I got a strange idea. So, I spent half an hour building this box, and it shouldn't have taken me half an hour because, but, you know, that's the, that's the trade-off for doing black concrete. Oh my gosh. I can barely see it. But, um, we're gonna build a spaceship. And now, <laughs> I'm not good at building this kind of stuff. So that's not my strong suit. I'm more into building um, houses. Which I think I've said that so many times. <laughs> but, you know, I like to speak the truth. And <laughs> that's the truth. Anyways, I thought it'd be interesting to do some sort of, like, space room, because there's not a space room. Slash, I don't know, weird, weird build that relies on dark. this for the bottom because it's a spaceship that carbon is there to um help it not be set on fire or help it not uh, help it help prevent it from killing every single passenger because like to keep their spaceship um, riders alive. It's starting to look like a space monorail or something. <laughs> a space train. Space train. Ugh. Space train, though. I'm never getting that back. And press Q. Oh, that destroys the carpets. That's that's funky. But like space train. I'm sorry, Bat. That's an interesting idea. Do a little tram system. Yeah, this is part of the other museum if you hadn't guessed. Do a tram system. I don't know how tall this is. Uh, one, two, three. second one one two three four five six seven eight nine one two three four five six seven eight nine and then 
same thing on the Thank you. Thank you, game. But same thing on this side. And then I guess we really can't do that. So we won't. It's poor people who get this one. Like, nobody would want this. Nobody would want any car other than the front car. And it, I wasn't. I wasn't planning on on doing this one, on on the, on doing an idea like this. But oh my gosh, this is kind of cool. And then, actually, let's have it go around a bend. One, one, two, one, one, two, one. So that's round. It's not round. One, two, one. One, two. Yeah, that's, that's good enough. So, one, two, three. Actually, I think, I, th I think that's um, big enough. Yes, like that. Why did I space it out? Now it's now it's gonna be long. And also, we'll have this one be the last one. And uh, geez, how will this be spaced like that? Okay. Fitting because you know just want everything in this museum to be kind of gross. Like okay, carpeting carpeting's cool. Carpeting's nice. But it also gets gross really easily. Of course the front one needs carpet. to my mind because it said stew when I was typing in you. Dude, I just had this stew and it tasted like heckin' Chef Boyardee's ravioli. But just the sauce. And it wasn't bad. It just wasn't good. Like, it doesn't bring up nostalgia, because I never really 
ate that kind of stuff. I never really ate that. Even though, like, every, everyone seems to have it in their memories. But no one that I talk to seems to, like, have eaten it or enjoyed it. Even. So why is it so popular in our minds? Why does everyone know it, but, like, not entirely know it? You know? Okay, I'm sorry. Again, Dude, it's a monorail through space. Space monorail. Okay, that was nowhere close to what I was planning on doing, but I mean, I, I didn't really have a plan either way. So yeah, thanks for watching.